I made this LM386 uh, IC amplifier a while back, but I never was able to find a good way to power it. And now I, uh, I got this USB power bank. Works very well with this setup here. So I just made a USB connector here, plug it into the USB, and uh, now I connected it to a better speaker and it seems to be working pretty well um, uses very little power so I'm gonna give it a short demo um, basically a lot of people have problem with hum and clicking noises and all that and I had a bit of problem when I tried to add the bass boost circuitry maybe I wasn't using the exact uh, components specify. I didn't want to spend a lot of money buying all the, all the different caps and um, so um, when I added the bass boost there was a bit of a clicking noise and, and hum so I just disconnected it. It would probably I find it easier just to use your iPad or your uh, iPod uh, equalizer to control the uh, frequency What's probably better that way and if you have a problem with hum just uh, try to use uh, a capacitor and uh, try to uh, touch different parts you know like um, the positive and, and the ground and um, even the positive and, and the speaker outputs you can try touching it and um, uh, you would probably uh, find at, at some locations the hum will be reduced. Right now if I were to put this across the speaker output it would change the frequency as well as uh, reduce whatever hum is there. So you could try doing that but uh, if you use a DC setup like this it would probably eliminate a big part of your hum. So I'm going to try using some of this YouTube free music here. Hopefully um, they won't flag me for uh, using the free music. This is from YouTube. So this is in mono, just single speaker. And if you notice the uh, Voltage and amp draw is minimal. It's less than half a watt. You can crank it up a little bit. And use the uh, control here. I mean, this is only like a This is only like a half watt amplifier, so don't expect too much. The 386 N4 uh, version, uh, would, it can put out up to one watt, but this is the uh, cheaper version, about half a watt. Not too bad. Again, in mono. Yeah, not bad. Let's try another. Let's see here. This is a very simple design. I push pin one and uh, eight, and uh, have a gain of I don't know, probably at least five times increase in gain. And if we were to do a bass boost, you can do 
the capacitor, resistor combo, and connects the gain, uh, pin 1 and pin 5. But this is without any uh, further uh, base C. Yeah. Thirty milliamps, forty milliamps. So the uh, power bank would make this setup portable. You can put this in any kind of housing, maybe like a project box like this, and uh, use any kind of decent speakers you have, and uh, use your iPod, your iPhone, or whatever. Yeah, it's halfway decent, isn't it? The chip is actually uh, less than a dollar. You can buy a LM386 amplifier on eBay for a couple of dollars with uh, all the jacks and uh, a 3.5 um, uh, power input. Um. Okay, thanks for watching. This is a very easy amplifier to make if you want to try it. There are a lot of schematics on the internet and uh, if I can make it, you can make it too. Have a good night.